guys! How are you doing? <laughs> Check out who we have here today! It's our friend Elsa! And we're going to continue playing our fun game! You guys have picked the colour purple! So we're going to use it to dye Elsa's hair! She's going to look great! Well, here is Elsa, guys. So first we take off her tiara. And now it's time to brush her hair. As you guys know, this is a very important step that we shouldn't skip. Because it makes her hair softer. And that way it's easier to dye it. Don't worry, Elsa. We won't pull your hair. Oh, look. She looks fantastic. Well, Elsa, you look much more relaxed you love getting your hair brushed don't you i do too <laughs> well now that we have some paint in our palette we put on our gloves and now it's time to get started here comes the fun part we dye elsa's hair we start by dyeing her fringe well done guys see see what i'm doing I'm using my hand. I put it under her hair so as not to get her face stained. This way it's much easier to dye her hair and to spread the paint. Here we go. Now we also dye her roots. Just like that. A little bit more. Here we go. We want the result to be great. So that's what we're aiming for. Look guys. We just apply paint all over her hair. We have to cover up all of her blonde hair. Soon enough, Elsa won't be blonde anymore. She will be purple haired. And I can't wait to see the final result. So far, I have loved all of the colours that you've picked for us to dye Elsa's hair. And today, we're dyeing it purple. And I'm sure she's going to look fantastic. Well, now that we've dyed most of her hair, it's time to dye her ends. Which is a very important part. And it does stay quite a while, so we must be patient, okay? Just like that. Ooh, look. A little bit more. Here we go. And now the last strand of hair. We're almost done with this section. We can't leave any blonde hair behind, okay? We have to get paint everywhere. Check it out, she looks great. I love the result. It looks great on you so far. Let's finish up the second section so that we can get to the final result. We start dyeing her fringe and her roots, just like that. Hey guys, do you want to hear a secret? Some of you might have already noticed, but for today's video, I washed Elsa's hair beforehand. This way, it's much easier to dye her hair. And I'm sure the result is going to be great. But don't worry, Elsa, because in previous makeover sessions, the result was fantastic. Well done, guys. The roots are down. So now we have to dye her ends. Oof, it won't be long now. Come on, guys. We're almost on. Wow, look. She looks fantastic! I love your hair colour, Elsa! Now, let's take care of the final details. We begin with her eyebrows. 
because as you guys know, since her hair is purple, so must be her eyebrows. Oof, this hasn't turned out very well, but don't worry, I have a really good tip for this. All right, we grab a baby wipe and get rid of the imperfections. Now comes the last part. We paint Elsa's hair purple so that it matches her hair and eyebrows. Little bit more. Although, I mean, your blue dress would look great with your purple hair, I have to admit. Wow, look guys! It's turned out great! Today we've dyed Elsa's hair purple and I love the final result! Please tell us in the comments what colour you'd like us to use next time! I hope you guys liked today's video! See you soon! Bye bye! Hi guys! How are you doing? Check out all of the stuff we have here today! This is all Ladybug merch! And here she is! Hi Ladybug! Yay! Hi kids! Oh, there are so many of you! Have you come to play with me today? We're going to have an amazing time together! Hmm, what could we do? What game could we play? I don't know. <gasps> What's this? Oh, hi there. Why are you all alone? Oh my god, guys. A new horse has showed up. And he seems fond of Ladybug. Aww. This is such a beautiful horse. And, oh, I just had an idea. What do you say we turn it into Ladybug's horse, huh? We could customize it to look like her. We could paint it red and then cover it in red dots. Yay! Yay let's do that! Yippee! I love the idea. And I think our friends are also in. So, should we get started? Let's dress up our horse. Okay, in order to do this, we're going to need this paint and many different materials. First we need red paint. Here we go. We're going to need lots of it. Because we have to paint Yippee! the horse all over. We've had such a fascinating idea, Ladybug. This horse is going to look just <laughs> like you. This horse is going to be so cool and original. I hope you like it. See? We have to cover the horse in red paint. Just like that. Very quickly. And now we use a little bit of water to spread the paint more easily. Here we go. We paint the legs. Ooh. Horses have such long legs. There are four of them so that they can ride really fast. Here we go. I love the way that horses ride. Have you ever ridden a horse? You can tell us in the comments. Yippee! Oh, have you ever been on a carousel? <laughs> Those horses are so beautiful. They go around really fast. And they go up and down and up and down and you just ride the horse and have a good time perfect see now we're going to use a small paintbrush to paint on the mask that's why we didn't paint the face Yippee! this horse is going to look amazing you can take him on your next adventure <laughs> Ooh. I wish I had a horse. I like seeing horses living naturally in the wild. Here we go. Now around the eye. Perfect. <laughs> Okay, 
Now we have to change color. So we wash our paintbrush. Now we squeeze out a big amount of blue paint. We dip our paintbrush in it. And now we apply it on the horse's mane. Because Ladybug has blue hair. So we have to dye our horse's mane blue. Just like that. Horses have such beautiful hair, don't they? I really like black horses. I find that they really shine in the light. But they come in all sorts of colors. They can be brown, white, they can be spotted. It's a very, very interesting world. It's a very intelligent animal. See, now we're painting the tail. Here we go, now on the other side as well. Now over here. See? Now we have to dye the fringe, of course. <laughs> Perfect! You look so handsome! Yay! We're done with the color blue and we clean our paintbrush. So now we can use black paint. Do you know what it's for? <laughs> it's for the dots, of course. They're very characteristic of Ladybug. <laughs> Here we go. We can add as many as we like. <laughs> We're using a small fine paintbrush, see? So that it's easier to make the dots. You guys can also try it at home. This would be much harder if we were using a bigger paintbrush. <laughs> These are all really cool tips, aren't they? Here we go. And now Yippee! the tips of the ears. See? <laughs> Just like that. And now the hind legs. Do you like dressing up horses? If you have any ideas, please tell us in the comments. We'd love to know. Here we go. And now the other leg. Just like that. Ooh. Yippee! Yay! Done! Oh no! We forgot about one last detail. We also have to add the dots on the mask. <laughs> Here we go. Yay! <laughs> Perfect! Here it is! This is now Ladybug's horse! What do you think of the result? Oh my god, look at these hands! So messy! Oh my god, guys! I love my new horse! I Yippee! love you! <laughs> we'll always be together from now on! Oh, he looks impressive! Yeah, I think we did a great job! Well, see you soon! <laughs> and they're off to a brand new adventure! Bye-bye!